Well, the game may have shifted from Little Rock to Fayetteville, but when it comes to LSU and Arkansas, not much has changed in this state. The Razorbacks with the football last, with the final seconds ticking away, with a chance to perhaps deal LSU heartbreak again. But the Tigers make just enough defensive plays at the end, and now LSU has legitimate hopes at a BCS Bowl after taking care of their business today. Our football team played extremely hard. I, uh, I know we missed tackles that we didn't wouldn't normally miss. That uh, uh, had we tackled a little crisper, could have separated ourselves maybe a little bit more by our opponent. The team that finishes four and eight on the year, making plenty of mistakes that exemplify a loser. Arkansas fumbling near LSU's goal line on the opening drive, muffing a punt they actually got back, missing field goals, and kicking a three-pointer from 17 yards that many people considered simply ridiculous. Their defense was having success with our offense, so. You know, I did understand the, uh, you know, the call. The Arkansas sideline even hit with a 15-yard penalty shortly before the 10-2 team made the play of the day and perhaps the catch of the year. Number one on ESPN's top 10 for sure. Uh, if it's not, I'm going to write a letter to, to the people up in Bristol. The throw was definitely uh, one of the best balls that I could have asked for in that situation. You know, the uh, defender being on me so tight inside, you know, he managed to throw it high and back shoulder, you know, and uh, he gave me a chance and trusted me and I just used my ability to make a play. LSU's leading rusher this year, Jeremy Hill, giving the Tigers a 17-3 lead thanks to an 86 seven yard kick return by last season's top ball carrier Michael Ford. Yeah it was a huge momentum set. We needed that. And um Mike, Mike, we love Mike man. He, he's, he's always making good big plays on kickoff return and he did that. We kind of wish he would score a touchdown. Uh, we're gonna give him a bit of trouble about not getting to the end zone. But no he made a great play. <laughs> Everybody else on the field it's um you know Mike gets all the credit for that but there was a lot of blocking that went on and um the scheme was great by Coach McGay. He everything just came together on that play how we wanted it to. And Odell Beckham third and ten catch on LSU's final drive certainly was significant. You saw the opening and it's like, man, I think I got it, but then, you know, it closed down so fast that you were just like, you know, hold on to the ball, stay in bounds. You know, clutch, that's two weeks in a row. You know, that's two weeks in a row for him, you know, uh, really uh, changing the game for us. Were they the BCS Bowl, you guys? Yeah, definitely, definitely. We compete with anybody, we feel like, and, uh, yeah, hopefully, uh, you know, everything works out to where uh, we can play for a BCS game. Reporting from Fayetteville, Arkansas, Jacques Doucet, WAFB 9 Sports.